Hello, my name is Leo from TL Lab. Today I'll present you concept of fusion process in IEC inertial electrostatic confinement fuser. Firstly, we have anode and cathode. Anode is positive and cathode negative electrode of fuser. Now we bring some gas into fuser. In our case, that gases are deuterium and tritium, which are isotopes of hydrogen. Now, they are captured by negative electrostatic potential of cathode and confined in the cathode. On that way, they lose electrons, so electrons are peeled of atoms, so only protons with neutrons are confined in the center of cathode here. And now they start acceleration and collisions in the cathode and due to that collisions begins process of fusion. In that process is created new chemical element helium its isotope helium-4 and also in each process is uh, in our case is released one neutron and also energy fusion process depends on energy that is provided to that process electric current and number of atoms of used fuel. Ratio of atoms that are fusioned and atoms that are not fusioned is very small. So there are lots more not fusioned than fusioned atoms. Fusion process cannot be exploited to generate additional energy, but it can be used to generate neutrons, so as neutron generator. I hope you learned something from this video. Thank you for watching.